the Crafted Rose. I just got my Lollipop Box Club box. And I said I wasn't really going to do um, a whole lot of hauls or unboxings. But I subscribed to this lady's website a little while ago. And um, so every month I get a box with planner supplies and crafting supplies. And um, it's from Great Britain, the UK. It's sent by Royal Mail, which I find I really enjoy that sticker. Um, so I'm going to open it. I haven't watched any of the other unboxing videos. I know like uh, Planning with Ellie usually does one. I'll link her channel below. And then the Lollipop Box Club also has a page or a channel where they show what, what's in these. So this one's a complete surprise. Um, I got my address covered up so y'all can't visit me. Uh, social distancing, doing what I can to help. Um, basically this is happening because I'm home and um, usually I'm a, a big fan of hermiting as I call it, but this uh, not being able to go anywhere is driving me nuts. So um, yeah. I'm gonna open this box. I like to try to save these so that um, if I get any orders, I can reuse the box. Um, all right, so it's Hello Spring. All right, so every box comes with this and it talks about um, what they're doing. Um, so they're collaborating with Pippa from Chimps Tea Party. And, um, so there's a bookmark in here from her, and there's other stuff as well. It comes with, like, a little card. Um, I'll probably give this to somebody at work. Sometimes I drop off little postcards to tell people thank you for being them and for helping out. I got my nails done a couple weeks ago and then refilled because I was enjoying the way they look, but it makes it so hard to do stuff. I'm getting used to having to use my finger blade to open things and things like that. Here's a little newsletter and it talks about making stuff with circles. And here's like a little um, journal card that you can cut out and put in a planner or something. And um, here's a recipe for lemon and blueberry crunch loaf. I'll probably give that to my offspring. She likes to bake. Um, and then April's packet is going to be called Secret Garden. And then I just found out I can sign up for a newsletter in the email. So that's cool. And then there's this card as well, which I'll probably, again, give to somebody at work. <clears throat> Everything's always packed so nicely. Here's the, <clears throat> the bookmark it mentions up here. <coughs> Excuse me. I, it's pollen season in Georgia, and I have terrible, terrible allergies. So um, paying that piper. I ran out of allergy medicine today. I have to go to work tomorrow, so I'll pick some up while I'm out tomorrow. And then here's some little planner stickers. Oh my gosh. These are so cute. Um, little tags and little talking bubbles. That would be great with some pictures and stuff. Oh my gosh. I'm super excited. This is fun. I love stickers too. This is like... Yeah, this is, I'm going to have a blast with this because I just, um, I just got a new happy planner and I've been using that and that's something I really like. Oh, this is pretty too. Notepads. I love me a good notepad. <gasps> oh my gosh. Little felt flowers. I'm not going to take them out of the bag, but there they are. Oh my gosh. There's some washi tape with some little flower buttons. I've got an idea of something I might do with that. And then here's a tag with some um, twine around it. And the tag it looks like it has just a little stamp on it. That's going to be so fun to use. Some more stickers. I really love me some stickers. The lollipop. These are always so good. I like lollipops. Some more stickers. These will go well um, with Easter, the Easter part of my planner. And then a pencil. Look how pretty that is. Okay. 
Um, the next two things are this bag and this bag. And then this um, tissue paper, I save it. And then if I need to wrap something in tissue paper, I usually reuse it or I try to use it on a craft. Um, and the same with these bags. Uh, they're reusable as well. Oh, a little tassel. I've been playing with tassels lately. I made some tassels a while ago and I've just been trying to put them in stuff. That's so pretty. I like tassels. Green's a good color too. And then there's another card. Some tags with leaves. Um, subscriber printables. Um, spring memories. A little like, journaling card. Oh, and then like some little typed words. Oh, I'm gonna have fun with that. And then, yep. I think that was everything in that bag. So, set the bag aside and kind of put these things in. Keep these out. They're gonna go with my planner. Those things in. This is gonna be so much fun. And then we're gonna open this guy. I should probably be gentler about this, but I will to have to Oh, she outdid herself. Look at that. Some really fun little photo mats or boxes that I could put around things. And then some paper that I will use. Um, actually, um, started making planners for people. Oh, you can hear my kiddo in the background. She's got the allergies too. And um, these are, ooh, they're so pretty. They might go well for cards, all sorts of things. And then these I really like because um, I can lay out my week and figure out like what am I going to do with my life. And then this, I'll probably hang it up over here so I can keep track of the days and what I have coming. So, yeah. This is a really nice pack, and I can't wait to use some of these things. Thank you for opening my mail with me. I'm going to just kind of close this all back together. These will go on top and so take them to work for people. This I could do... I kind of want to put in like a little photo mat with like so they can people can tuck it. We'll see. And then yeah. So and these I'll put on top as well. So I can take them to work with me tomorrow. And that's it. Thank you so much. Bye.